So my mother's angry with me, as opposed to being very happy. I went to Redondo Beach Pier today, yeah. and now she's getting her, her pot again to mean she's making coffee. It's like a, a complete reaction, Mom. I make coffee, I come here, and you make coffee. I'm not making coffee. Are you that angry you're going to go get a bottle of alcohol instead? Yeah. Wine? Alice. So I went to Redondo Beach. Uh -huh. They don't have fresh anchovies, but a few. They had like three pounds. So it's I wanted... Enough. So I wanted five pounds. So they're frozen, but they're just frozen from yesterday frozen. They freeze them every day. They get them and freeze them. So we're just going to defrost them. And then you are going to fry them. Isn't that exciting? Oh yes, I'm thick of I know. <laughs> okay, well, so these are anchovies. My mother thought that I got sardines. But these are anchovies, Ma, aren't they? They're small and they're blue. So... What color are sardines? The green. And the smelt are white. Alice. I researched. No, you didn't research nothing. I did research. So, here's the thing. When I was little, my mother used to get fresh sardines... Sard what are these? Anchovies. Fresh anchovies in at the pier. Redondo Beach. And... Um, she would bring them home, flour them, salt them, and fry them, and they were delicious. So anchovies have a terrible taste if they're canned. They're very pungent, whatever. But when they're fresh, it's like a trout, like a baby trout. So it's just like little fried fish, um, little fresh fried fish. So this is what we're going to have. So my mother's going to defrost them in cool water. I guess sort of like what you do with the turkey. So Because I don't want these in my refrigerator overnight. And tomorrow we're having barbecue, so... We're going to make them tonight. So we're going to defrost them. They're going to go in his cool water for a little bath. And then we'll see what she does. Because honest to God, I don't know how to make them. But I'm assuming she's going to take the to heads off. Now. You have to clean them, Mom. You should put on an apron because you can get dirty. <laughs> I have an apron at home if you'd like. I have an apron, thank you. I don't even know what it means to clean them. So we'll come back. I'll show it to you. I think you need to show me for five pounds worth. Okay, everybody, today is going to be a day where my mother probably uses awful language at me. But you haven't made them in a long time, Mom. I'm doing this for you. It's a gift. <laughs> so, okay, we'll be back. Okay, so how do you clean the anchovy? With a knife and a cutting board that we want to throw away. You see, my hand isn't good anymore for so this. Well, we can have Lydia come and help. Yeah. Or Ginny. So what needs to happen to them? Hmm? What what needs to happen to them? How do you clean them? If I don't clean the bag, I have to put this stuff in there. What stuff is going inside this bag? This. What is this? What was that? You took off the head. Oh my god. So she's deheading, decapitating. What's happening to this anchovy? I need to look. What I can't even see what's happening. You cut its head open and the tummy. Is that what you're doing? Mm -hmm. Let me see this. How did you take, how did you do that? And what's that that's inside coming out? Why don't we just leave everything inside so that everybody, when they eat it, they can clean it? I don't understand. I'm not seeing this well. So you're snapping the head and then pulling. Yeah, no, I can't clean these. I'll get you an apron. Huh? I'll get you an apron. I don't need an apron now. It's... I can't clean these. That's not happening. The only problem is my hand isn't good anymore. So I'll get somebody. I'll have Lydia come help you. Yeah, so Lydia's going to do this. But I'm not doing it. Hush, bitch. Okay, I'm going to be the brave person. Wash my hands, put on an apron, and come help. Why can't we do this with a knife? How are you going to do this with the knife? Cut the head off. And then? And then get a scooper to take out the inside. A scooper? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. This is worse than the eggplants yesterday. Ooh. Okay, so my mother, she's almost done. Look, she's cleaned all these anchovies, this poor woman. I'm not helping with this part. So she found a fish. Oh, she's gutting that one. So that's we know how that's done. Look at this little fishy. 
Isn't he a cute little thing? How he's stuck in there. What happened to him? That's not an anchovy. It looks like he got flat. What kind of fish is that? I don't know, but I don't know how to clean it. I think I need a scissor for this. You gotta cut him open. I'll get a scissor. But look how cute he is. Ma, you're hurting him. You're hurting him. Okay, we're not gonna take video of this anymore. This poor little fishy. My mother's complained that there's a mess up here. So I need to bleach and then lemon her sink because it smells like fish. So I have a big bag of lemons from and limes from my yard. Her hands smell. So I appreciate her doing this and not me doing it. Cause then Riley would eat me. I think some cats are gonna come outside mom and line up at your house. <laughs> Cause they smell the fish. So we have two layers of the breaded anchovies that have no heads and no in internal internal guts or whatever left. They're not breaded, they're floured. Oh. Well, see, that's why you're here. Thank you. So they're floured and we didn't put salt on them. We put salt after they're fried when they come out. Yeah. Okay. So we're going to go outside now. We're taking our cooking show outside because we're not frying this inside the house. And, um, we're gonna cook at the barbecue, we're gonna fry them, and then we need to deliver them nice and hot. Did you put the... the fire on? Yeah. No. I had to put oil in the pan too, so you could take a break. Would you like a cup of coffee? No, I had coffee. Would you like a glass of scotch? Okay. So I just need a few minutes um, to organize outside, and we'll be back. So we're outside now, and it's windy, as you can hear the fire, or the flame is burning, I mean, is moving. So my mom is frying these anchovies. She tested one, so that's how they look fried. And we're going to salt them when they come out. So they're gonna be very basic, delicious food. You could pretend that you're in Italy, in Naples, or in Sorrento, or someplace eating these nice, warm um, anchovies by the sea um, that just have a little bit of salt on them. Um, and that'll be your vacation. How is it, Ma? It's cooked? I made my mother taste because I wasn't sure if it's cooked or not. So once they're all done, we'll show you our finished product.